Northwestern okay. Library. How can I help you? Hi. Um, I'm a new grad student. It's actually my first day. Um, and I'm on the library page. And this is embarrassing, but I don't know how to sign into my account. Can you help? Of course. Are you looking at the library homepage now? Yep. Awesome. So if you can go to the upper right corner where it says my account and click that. Okay, got it. Okay. And now if you can enter your net ID and password. Is that what I use to log in to Canvas and check my email? Yes, exactly. It starts with a few letters and ends with a few numbers. Okay, great. I put it in. So while I'm signing into things, can you tell me how to set up my interlibrary loan account? Of course. So the first time you sign into interlibrary loan, you need to fill out some information. But once you've done that, the requesting process is really simple. So it's a good idea to go ahead and get this step out of the way. The good news is you're already halfway there. So you're on your account page and you see in the center, there's a section for interlibrary loan and a link that says sign into your ILL account. So click that. Yep. Now it wants my MFA. Hey, I don't have my MFA yet. This is literally my first day of graduate school. <laughs> that, that was a grad joke. I know it's multi-factor authentication. Let me check my phone. Okay, I'm in. Okay, great. So now you're going to go ahead and fill out the required fields, such as your name and address. You're going to choose a pickup location that will apply for all of your ILL requests. If you, you would like off-campus delivery, select distance education student. If you want to pick up at the main library, you would go ahead and choose Maine as your pickup location. You can change this information at any time by going to change your information. So don't worry if you change your mind about how you want to receive your books. So once you fill that out, go ahead and hit submit and you're done signing up. Is there anything else you need help with? No, I think I'm ready to start grad school. Thanks for your help. Northwestern Library, how can I help you? Hi, can you help me get a book? Sure. Is it a physical book you want? Yes, it is. I need a copy of Fahrenheit 451. Great. Let me show you how to look that up in our library catalog, New Search. Okay, here it is. Now you see it says sign in for request options. So you're going to click there and sign in. Perfect. Okay. Now, now you can see the request options and you can choose the, to pick the book up in the library. Um, is that what you want to do? Yes. Okay. Request the book, choose the main library for pickup. Our staff will pull it from the shelves and when it's ready, you'll get a notification. Then what you'll do is you'll make an appointment to pick up the book. Sound good? Yeah, that sounds good. Thank you. Oh, shoot. I forgot. So I live in Florida, so I can't come to the library? Oh, <laughs> that's not a problem. We can send the book to you. Just choose home delivery instead of pickup. Be sure to put your street address and zip code in the notes field. We'll send you an email when it ships. Amazing. Thank you so much. Hi, I need a book and I'm not finding it in the catalog. Sure, I can help with that. What's the title? It's called A People's History of Chicago by Kevin Koval. Hmm, let me take a look in the catalog. So you're right, we don't own that, but let's use the link here to see if we can find another library that has it. So have you used your interlibrary loan account before? I have. Great. So you can click the link that says NU at ILL, log in with your net ID and password, and the citation information will be filled in for you automatically. Then go ahead and hit submit. All right, that's it. Notifications will come to you the same way they would for a Northwestern book. 
Oh, that's super easy. Thanks. You're welcome. Hello, Northwestern Library. Hello, I have a question. So I read this book and it was great. And there's a piece of scholarship on it that I really want to read, but it's from 1954 and it's not online. <laughs> oh gosh. I know, but you have the journal in your um, Oak Grove. Is that a place I can go and look at this journal? Only I'm in Hyde Park and I'm not really sure how I get there. Okay, so Oak Grove is our offsite storage facility. And the easiest way for us to get this to you is to send you a digital copy. So what we'll do is scan the article for you and provide it to you online. That way you don't have to go anywhere and you'll have what you need much more quickly. Oh, that's great. Actually, that's really great because I have a real tendency to sneeze around old books. Can <laughs> you show me how to request something like that? Of course. So the first thing you're gonna do is log into your library account and then go to your interlibrary loan account. So on the side is a link that says article or chapter request. Just click on that and enter the citation with as many details as you have. And if you have any special requests or concerns, just leave a note in the notes field and our staff will see it and take care of it for you. Oh, cool. So if I want a chapter, like a chapter from a book, I can use the same form? Absolutely. That is good to know. Thank you very much. Yeah, you're so welcome. Anything else I can help you with? Nope, I'm all set. Thanks. All right, take care. Bye.